Good morning. This is Dr. John Bennett. Uh, we have an impromptu uh, presentation by Victor Hugo Perez Perez uh, of Mexico City. Uh, he's a, a well-known neuroanatomist, uh, and right now we're going to do an impromptu uh, presentation by Victor uh, of the latest technology in doing dissections of the brain and, and spinal cord. We're joined by a few members of the panel. I'll let them introduce themselves first. First, we'll start with uh, Ipe. Good morning, Ipe. Good morning, John. Good morning, John. Okay, uh, BD, could you introduce yourself, please? I'm going to start this uh, beautiful injection. Okay, I guess we'll start. The, I guess we'll spine. start. Okay. Go ahead, Victor. I'm sorry to interrupt. Okay, this, this is the injection of the veins of the posterior aspect of the spinal cord, of a human spinal cord. Uh, what I am doing in this video is to inject the veins. And then after, we can study these uh, veins and arteries of the spinal cord. Uh, Once we have injected the big veins, there is a small veins that cannot be injected because of uh, its size. But the big veins are uh, uh, well, very well injected. I'm going to show you uh, another, an, another, another one, please. Uh, uh, just, uh, just a few minutes. Okay, uh, you 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 have seen this, so okay. Okay. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, we can. We can. Okay. So this you can probably tell the to do This is brilliant, Victor. This is brilliant. Yeah. Let, let me show you uh, other other uh, a nice uh, uh, dissection. Uh, this one. This is the Willis uh, circle. This is the supraclinal segment of the carotid artery, both carotid arteries. I have uh, too many videos of this kind of dissection, so uh, we can really do a good job in microsurgical anatomy, uh, not also the brain, also the skull base, and also the spine. So I think that we are going to to do a, a good job in, in this kind of uh, work. So uh, let me let me 
uh, find another files and I like to show you that uh, is uh, 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 do you agree with that? Let me find another another uh, pictures. Do you agree? Yeah, okay. Okay. In uh, three minutes or four minutes. Okay. Uh, you know, uh, I'm going to ask, uh, I, I, what, is, what is so unusual about, about what Victor's doing? Uh, guys, sorry, I had a I had a call from theater. So oh, I just okay. Talked. Yeah. Well, what is so unusual about what you see there? Um, no. First of all, uh, I have never seen a live injection like this, I mean, except in our lab, which has been very patchy, which is not uh, which doesn't have the one hundredth of quality of uh, what Victor is doing right now. We have tried injections, but it has never come out this good. Uh, but I have seen some injected specimens, which is already injected, so I don't see it going light. Oh, okay. But this is, this is really brilliant because I'm seeing it happening, the infection hap uh, happening. Also. So that's great. I would really like to see some skull base, for example, the basilar or the ICA. Uh, I mean, th those kind of pictures I would like to see with Victor. So maybe if uh, he, this is this lab is that good, maybe we can uh, talk to WFM's World Federation of Neurosurgery. Uh, the anatomy uh, committee chairman is Vladimir uh, Benesh, who is a good friend and a member of the uh, WFNS anatomy committee. We can have his lab as one of the WFNS anatomy centers in uh, yes. South America. Yes. So yes. this would yes. be amazing because uh, his uh, injection seems to be absolutely fantastic. Yeah, we we are discussing that. We would like to televise his dissections live on, on the neurosurgical TV with his uh, lab in in Mexico City. Uh, what What do you think, Professor Sinha? Yes. Yeah, uh, definitely is uh, excellent, and uh, I've never seen such uh, uh, presentation. It's a excellent, beautiful, and uh, we must support him. For, uh, and you must invite him frequently for his demonstration. We should call him to India for some skull base meeting, perhaps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's excellent. It's amazing. I've never seen before like this. Uh, this is a spinal cord. And yes. Uh, uh, this is a. Uh, this is the. Uh, Adam Kievich artery, this one, mm. and this is uh, the all the roots in the caudaquina, and in here we are seeing the great spinal vein of the anterior aspect of the spinal cord. So I am moving. Uh, some roots in order to see this very interesting uh, artery. This artery mm. is supposed not to find in the spinal cord. Some authors about uh, 30 or 40 years ago described this artery, but others uh, argumented that this artery doesn't exist. I can demonstrate that this artery does exist. This is the great spinal artery, great posterior spinal artery, this one. And this is the Adakiewicz artery. So, uh, I have uh, too many videos about this anatomy, and it's really fantastic to 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 find a several anatomical variants in this. This is the medullary conus. 
and the mm. vein of the phylum terminal, the tri 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 bifurcation, trifurcation of the Adamkiewicz artery. The this is the arachnoid tissue. These are the thoracic artery. This is the thoracic artery. This one are really small. I have all the measures uh, of the cervical arteries, thoracic arteries, Adamkiewicz arteries. Okay, le le let me find, uh, please, let me find, uh, give me three minutes in order to find another file that I want to show you, okay? These are the these are the cervical arteries. It's brilliant reception, eh? Brilliant. I wish Salman was here to see this. Salman is this fine guy, so he's on a conference call with the uh, it's fresh cadaver. Yeah, uh, this is this is a fresh cadaver. Uh, it's not possible to do this in in all the cadavers. Okay. It's not possible. Okay, let, let, let me find. Um, Okay, I, I, I get it. I get it. Uh, oh. Okay. Okay, 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 let me. Okay, uh, uh, give me one minute, please. Professor Sinha, we should start something like this in India. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah fantastic. And uh, uh, the problem is a fresh cadaver. I think uh, now we don't have problem. And it's always also we have a start. Uh, we have been asked for fresh cadaver to our local police authorities. And, uh, uh, if we can get that, we can uh, do all this. Uh, this is real world class work. No doubt about it. Yeah, and uh, in our neurosurgery department from 1st of July, uh, ah. we have a new room of the cadaver resection hall. So ah. we have an extension of neurosurgery department. We have a new room. We can start look, the cadaver resection. Look, look the direction yeah. of the very special. Uh, this is the posterior, posterior spinal artery. And look, uh, this, mm. the, this is the injection. Excellent. <laughs> uh, 
Okay. Uh, let's go to see another. Uh, let me show you other one. This, this is not so good, like others. This uh, is uh, the spinal cord, the veins. This is the posterior aspect of the spinal cord. There's the arachnoid. Yes. And it's because uh, he's, uh, he's showing it on another computer and he's taking it. No, he's showing it on another computer. He's uh, showing the video. That's why it's Yeah. No. So I, I'd like to share this uh, kind of job, of job you so uh, uh, we can we can make a, a good job in, in, in this kind of uh, of an video a video poster circulation or uh, excuse me you do have video of posterior circulation and or brain stem or some very uh, eloquent uh, videos. Basil are actually posterior circulation. Yeah, I, I, I have the videos of uh, of uh, this uh, uh, of of all of these uh, injections. Um, you guys doing okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Okay. okay. Uh, look at this one. This is the anterior aspect of the spinal cord. Oh, um, yeah. This is the posterior spinal artery. It's similar mm. to the to the Adamkiewicz artery, this one. But it's smaller than the Adamkiewicz artery. Really nice uh, artery. Mm. I am demonstrating uh, this artery in 50 spinal cords. Uh, it's present in about 70% of the spinal cords. So right now I am preparing a paper to, to in, in, in um, cardiothoracic uh, uh, surgery or also in neurosurgery. 
Uh, what do you think about uh, this uh, dissection, doctor? Good. Very good. I think uh, I've seen first time. Yeah. Well, you know, I, I can't say too much, uh, Victor. I haven't seen any dissections of the spinal cord before live. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Okay. So, what do you think, Doctor? Uh, uh, Leap, uh, Leap. I, I, Victor. My name is will be I. I, I. Yes, yes, Victor. Uh, I think your uh, dissections are amazing. Uh, great. I mean, I have never seen such dissections. Um, I am wondering that why I haven't heard of you because uh, neurosurgical anatomists uh, we know only Christoph and uh, there's one more chap, uh, Igor Maldonado from Brazil. So these are the guys we know of. So it's a fantastic uh, opportunity to meet somebody like you who does this kind of world class work. And probably uh, I will talk to the WFN's anatomy uh, chairman, anatomy committee chairman, uh, Vladimir Benesh. Yeah. Uh, he's from Czechoslovakia, so he, I will talk to him saying that uh, we had this fantastic uh, uh, presentations from a gentleman from Mexico and uh, if you're willing, you should be part of the WFNS Anatomy Committee and uh, maybe we should come to uh, Mexico sometime and see your lab and see your technique and uh, see your anatomy and probably learn from you. Uh, and also when the next master's meeting is on, we will send you an invitation wherever it is, if it is in South America, Europe, wherever, India, wherever it is, we will send you an invitation and then if you are willing to come and attend this faculty and uh, show your presentations, we will be more than glad. What do you feel, Dr. Singh? Huh? You heard that, Victor, right? Yes. yes. You understood that? Yes. Did you hear that, Victor? Yeah, yeah, yes, of course. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I, I like to participate, uh, showing this kind of work uh, to all of you. So uh, I'm going to participate in the school-based conferences in Brazil, and thank you very much, uh, Doctor Ipe, because uh, that invitation is uh, from you, and I hope to make a, a congress here in Mexico City and I am going to invite you uh, to these uh, conferences. Uh, could be next year, um, probably April or, or, or May of the next year. Uh, I will be very happy to see you in this uh, nice uh, country, in this nice uh, Place Mexico City. Yeah, we, we hope to show Victor Hugo Perez Perez to the neurosurgical world yeah. on neurosurgical TV. Professor Sinha, yeah. what do you, Professor Sinha, uh, what, would be, what would your opinion be? How, do you think we should tie up with uh, Professor Victor in uh, terms of learning from him how to do these anatomical dissections? And uh, as since you are doing the skull base meeting this time, uh, what yeah. what would be why can't you just, uh, we can invite for this uh, meeting also him. Victor can come to this meeting. And uh, I think it is a uh, good presentation. And we have never seen before. Uh, I, from my side, you can invite him for this meeting. Victor, Professor Sinha is organizing a skull-based meeting, which is the largest, one of the largest skull-based meetings in the world because it's from India. So, would you like to come uh, for this uh, meeting as a faculty? Uh, Dr. Professor Sinha is asking you whether you would like to come to India as faculty in September. In September? Yeah. This year? Yeah, this year. This year? Yeah, of course. Uh, l l let me show you this. This is very nice. Uh, let me show you this, please. Uh, yeah, I'll give you his card. Yeah. Oh, uh, I.
It's really impressive uh, the vascular anatomy of the brain, oh, yeah. the, of the spinal cord. So if, uh, if it is possible to go to India, I will be happy to be there in September this year. And yeah. if you want, I can talk about uh, the uh, arteries of the brain, the skull base anatomy, or also the spinal cord. Uh, in the spinal cord, I have uh, too many, too many work done. Uh, I would like but, to uh, almost change you the skull base. The skull base meeting. Okay, no problem. I, I have too many jobs in, in the skull okay. base. Uh, too many dissections. I, I, will, I, will, I, will, I will contact with you. I will send email to you. Okay. Yeah, yeah uh, I, I, gave, I gave him your email address, Victor. Okay. Yeah, I got you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I, I also, uh, I'm going to send you an email in order to be in contact okay. and to share this work with you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We're, 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 you know, he gave a great talk yesterday, uh, VD and I, and and we're gonna edit it. But he has six videos in his presentation. <laughs> Excellent presentation. Excellent. A, a lot of a lot of great anatomy. You want to show some more things, Victor? No, uh, I think uh, uh, they are. Uh, 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 no. Okay, okay, I'll just wrap this up so we can uh, send it as a separate video. Thank you very much, Victor, for, for this impromptu uh, neuroanatomy session. Uh, and, you, and you've seen the power of the Internet, making a connection and actually maybe going to speak at a conference. Uh, we, yes. saw it we saw it live and we have it on tape. So thank you very okay. much. Okay. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Yeah, you can, you're welcome to stay, Victor. You can, you're welcome to stay. Uh, we're going to have okay. another presentation. Uh, l let me... Uh, Okay. And I, I, I neglected to introduce uh, Gorab. He's a medical student. Can you say hello to the panel, Gorab? You got to unmute yourself there. Un unmute yourself. You're, you're still muted. You're muted. Okay. There you go. He's mute. Yeah. There you go. I didn't want to interrupt uh, yet, so I didn't speak, speak anything. Uh, so my greetings to every teachers there. Could you introduce yourself, uh, please? Yeah, I'm Gaurav Bhatta. I'm studying medical uh, medicine in College of Medical Sciences uh, in the same college of Dr. I.P. Uh And I'm glad to be a part of this. Well, you know, um, I, I tell all the students, uh, I.P. and uh, V.D. and uh, Victor, they're intimidated by neurosurgeons. But I tell you, this is a golden opportunity. As a medical student, I, I know you guys remember that it was rare that you were in a room with three neurosurgeons. Very rare. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's <laughs> my honor. I'm very uh, thankful to uh, Sir John and I.P. sir, and uh, even uh, to everybody. Uh, yeah, we, we hope to encourage students participating in these type of hangouts yes, and also with with a developing neuroanatomy channel that hopefully Victor will be part of uh, where he can live stream the sections uh, and they'll be interactive. You'll be able to talk to Victor uh, on on so a platform like this and say, Victor, what's this nerve? What's this artery? Etc. Uh, it's different than watching a video. Being able to talk to someone like Victor.